besties and welcome back to my channel. My name is Annalise and I'm super excited for today's video because we are doing my favourite style of video and that is a high heel haul. As you guys know, I'm obsessed with high heels. I'm the self-proclaimed queen of high heels and therefore when Kaku, a sub brand of Shein, reached out to me asking if I wanted to review their high heels on my channel, I of course said yes. So if you haven't heard of Kaku before, as I said, they are a sub brand of Shein. They knit sparkle dreams by being customer focused, responding rapidly to changing needs, lifting consumers' confidence and guiding their way to empower women. Their style is cool yet fabulous, fitting perfectly for these women who take fearless steps. And since this video is sponsored, I of course have a discount code for you guys. So if you use the code CPH44, you get an extra 15% off the entire site. So the, all of these heels will be linked down below as long as a link to where you can buy them, which is on G. So today we have this massive heavy box of high heels to go through. Oh my, 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 my life. So Kuku is the sponsor of today's video. However, as always, I'm going to give you guys my real honest and raw opinion on all of these high heels, y'all know the drill. But without further ado, let's get into this big and slightly overwhelming box of heels. Let's kick this off with a pair that I did tease on my Instagram because when I saw open this box, this pink pair was on top and how could I not open it and just have like a quick look. I haven't tried them on, but I did open them up to see what they were like. I'm not gonna front to y'all, I, I did, I did. And when you see them, you'll understand why, you'll get it. Because these are the heels! Ah, they are these pink high heels that have been packaged well with all of this, but I'm just taking that out, with a little bow on the front. Now, I am, of course, so excited for this new Barbie Ruby with M Ruby? Barbie movie with Margot Robbie in it, and these heels just give off that perfect Barbie vibe with the pink, the bow, and I like that they have this plastic bit here to help keep your foot in. So, let's open up the other one. I'm talking so fast because I'm so excited by these heels that my mouth literally can't keep up. But are these not the most gorgeous heels ever? Now, I know some of you lately are struggling to understand my style and I get messages every now and then that's like, I miss the pink Annalise. Don't worry, I'm still here. I'm still here. I just wear pink every now and then instead of all the time. And I think that these are a perfect example of that. I love them. It is that knitwear material that I described earlier that Kuku is all about. So, of course, we're going to do the classic Annalise Wood test and pull on these heels to see what the structural integrity is like. So this one is a okay. And let's see this one. I don't want it to break. So I love these. This one is also okay. Ah, these are so gorgeous. Honestly, it's gonna be tough to beat these because these are absolutely stunning and I cannot wait to put them on. So let's go do it. Here we have the pink heels on. Now, I really thought I was gonna style this a lot more girly than I did, but I realized I don't really own many hot pink items. All of the pink items that I own are more of a baby pink. So I'm definitely gonna keep that in mind next time I'm doing a sheet and all that. I'm gonna get some more um, hot pink items. So instead, I paired it with this hot pink top and then some black jeans, which, I can wear this season because I feel like with a lot of these high heels I'm gonna style them very summer-esque but this I could wear this season just with a cute little jacket over the top and this is a gorgeous fit. I really love messing around with the juxtaposition of like super girly top, super girly shoes and then like not so girly jeans and belt and I feel like it's just a gorgeous outfit. I am obsessed but these high heels are really comfortable considering that they are really tall like that is a high stiletto. They're actually pretty comfortable and I think it's because it has an extra little bit of plastic keeping my foot in place and the material that my foot like the ball of my foot is on is a nice soft comfy like cushiony material and that is helping to alleviate some of that pain. Obviously after wearing these for a while they're gonna start to hurt that's just a given but overall I really love these and I cannot wait to wear these. I need to like go to dinner or something because this is a gorgeous outfit. This next item appears to be orange. These are Oh my goodness, crazy. This sort of block heel is extremely on trend right now, especially with those Versace Bratz doll inspired heels. And I feel like this is a similar vibe to that. I used to not really wear high heels like this just because I felt like I was too tall, but lately I've decided that I do not care and I have been wearing them. So again, it's this knit material, which I think is actually gonna be really comfortable on my toes. I'm hoping so, at least. And I love the diamantes up here that are gonna wrap around and just add that extra little bit of detail. So let's pull on the heels. As always, we're going to do this with all of them. That one is pretty good, pretty good, hasn't fallen. Same with this. One of these days, I'm going to do this on a high heel and it's going to break off and I'm not going to know what to do with myself from there, but let's go put these on. Here we have the orange high heels on and I'm like crossing my fingers that I still fit in the frame because these are really, really tall, but I love them. I feel like this is such a fun summer outfit. Can you tell I'm missing summer? I've been mentioning it so much in this video. I hate winter. I hate winter. But anyway, these shoes are, like I expected, really comfortable. Because they've got that big block heel and the big platform, they are super comfortable and really easy to walk in. The only thing is, is that 
this tie up thing doesn't stay up so it doesn't provide you with much support like as you're walking but that's okay because you do have the big toe strap to keep everything in place so I really like these I love this outfit so much it's actually really good with jeans and then like a coral top because it took me a while to put this outfit together this is such like a weird pose to chat in but it took me a while to put these this outfit together because this isn't really orange it's more coral so it didn't match any of my orange shirts that I have but if you have a coral shirt with some jeans that would look super funky and fresh so I love these heels and I cannot wait to wear these coffee break in my bare cup yes I still collect Disney mugs I love them this is a very strong coffee it's my second of the day I'm addicted to coffee these next pair of heels I cannot remember what they were at all they are black Oh, with a clear heel, okay. Oh, okay, they're the same as the pink ones from earlier, except this time they're in black and they have the bow. Oh, I misspoke as well, sorry. It's not a clear heel, the heel is silver. But these are super cute. They're very similar to the pink ones from earlier. However, these ones were a pointed toe, these have a square toe, these have the extra little plastic bit and these don't. And are they the same high heel height? Yes, they are. Okay, so it'll be interesting to see how comfortable these are to walk in just because they don't have that plastic bit that the pink heels did. But I love these. A black pair of heels you can never go wrong with, especially one that's like fairly classy like this and just has that little bow detail. These are absolutely stunning. Going to be so gorgeous. Love it. Love it. Let's... Oh, wait, no. I'm going to pull in the heels. Please don't snap. You are beautiful. I always get a little more nervous with these stilettos. Okay, then I do with the block heels because it's just less keeping it together. Okay, we're all good. Whew. Okay, so let's go style these. Now I love all of the outfits that I've put together so far in this video, but this, come on, this is absolutely gorgeous. This is definitely my favorite so far. This cute little black and white dress with the little bow high heels. It's like Audrey Hepburn, but modern, and I am obsessed with this, and most importantly, sorry to my downstairs neighbors, obsessed with these heels. So, I was a little concerned on how I was going to be able to walk around in these, just because the pink ones had that extra little bit of clear, and I was like, oh no, are these going to be really difficult to walk in, but they're actually not too bad. As you guys can probably see, my foot is on quite an arch, so this sort of high heel is definitely not for beginners, but if you've worn heels for a while like I have, it's totally fine to walk in. My feet are going to hurt after a while, don't get me wrong, that pain never ever goes away. You can be wearing high heels your entire life, you will still get high heel pain because it's unnatural for our feet to be like this, obviously, but it'll be okay. I'm not going to do lots of walking in these, these are more like a dinner shoe, but like look at this Oh, I love it so much. We have a pair of what I think are nude white heels here. And I gotta be honest, if these are the ones I think they are, yeah. These were actually inspired by Amber Scholl. She did a YouTube video recently. Ah, I just jammed my finger. But she did a video recently where she went to Louis Vuitton, Louis Vuitton, sorry, not Louis Vuitton. I always get them confused. Louis Vuitton and bought a pair of white high heels that were just like plain white and they were strap up details. So when I saw fairly similar on Shein, I was like, that's more in my budget than Louis Vuitton's and I loved the design. So I'm gonna get these instead. Okay, so this is the high heel. It is a nude heel that as you can see on the front, it has that classic kaku knit material. But then as on the straps, it is covered in crystals and it can tie up and will look absolutely stunning. So as I said, these were semi-inspired by Amber Scholl. These are just the Shein version. And I really love the little diamonds on them. And I love these sort of high heels. First of all, I like them because this kind of looks like a diamond to me. I know it's not really, but I've always just thought of it like that with this sort of design. But it does give you a little bit of extra support since it's not just a straight stiletto. It grows out and has that extra support there. So let's pull on these heels and see. Please. Oh, Okay, it made a cracking noise, but it's all good. I really, I had a moment of fear there. I won't lie to y'all. The fear was real. The fear was real. Okay, these didn't crack either. Amazing. So, let's go put these bad boys on. Also, this is how they come, like, in the right packaging, all done up. I just untangled them, obviously, to show you. These are what these gorgeous sparkly shoes look like on, and I'm obsessed with these. So, as I said earlier, I've just kept this on with the dress that I was wearing. But these are literally stunning. Like, I don't know why these sparkly high heels are extra sparkly, but they are literally glistening in the light here, and I am obsessed with them. I love these so much. So, these are really comfortable. The knitted part on my toes is so very comfortable. It literally feels like I have a cushion there, which is absolutely amazing, because if I get blisters from wearing high heels, it's always on my toes, and that is just the worst. When you're on a night out, you're dancing, or you're, yeah, because this is how you dance on a night out, Annalise, but you know what I mean. You're dancing, you're walking around, rah, 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 I always get blisters on my toes, and it's just so extremely painful. So, to have this knitted material really makes these a lot more comfortable, which is absolutely amazing because these are gorgeous. I cannot wait to wear these out. I don't know when I'm going out next, but when I do, you best believe I am wearing these sparkly heels because they're so beautiful. 
beautiful. I just literally, as you can see, I can't stop looking at them because the sparkles are just stunning. And I actually really like that the Tari doesn't have the sparkle on it as well because I think it just draws more attention to the sparkles. And if you're someone that's a little bit shorter, these sort of high heels are absolutely amazing because it has the clear high heel and the nude um, heel, like the toes and everything are nude, it makes your legs look a lot longer and the strappy details helps to elongate your legs. Obviously not an issue I have, I am quite tall, I'm 5'9", but you know, it is a tip for any shorter gals out there. I'm obsessed with these, can't recommend them enough. Time for another coffee break. I did tell you guys that this was a massive haul because we've still got a puff. I did tell <laughs> all of these coffee breaks are really getting to my brain. But what I tried to say there was I did tell you guys this was a massive haul because we've still got another couple of pairs to go. And next up we have another pink pair of heels, which I love. Oh, these are such a gorgeous summer shoe, which just makes me miss summer so much because I hate winter. But these are the shoes. We're here for the shoes, Annie, not my opinion on the seasons. They are these beautiful pink high heels that have the little knit detail on the toe. I Again, keeping with the theme and they have these pink ribbons to tie up your leg they have these gorgeous heels as well that as I said reminds me of a diamond so let's pull on these okay that one is all good let's open up this other one and pull on it as well amazing that is all good as well these would be great on vacation because the high heel isn't too crazy so if you do have to do a little bit of walking these would be perfect whereas like those other pink heels probably recommend for like dinner or somewhere where you don't have to stand too much so i'm obsessed with these let's go for them on. okay i feel like every time i put on a pair of high heels i'm like this is my favorite outfit so far but like this is my favorite outfit so far because these pink tie-up heels match perfectly with this pink tie up top isn't this so cute y'all see what i mean how i thrive in summer outfits and then winter outfits i'm just like what the heck do i wear you know i really struggle i struggle hard i feel like this video has just turned into annalise wood hates winter you know but anyway these are what the high heels look like on again these are super comfortable i think it all comes down to that knitwear material that these are all made out of because it literally feels like you're wearing a pillow if only it was on like the sole as well oh that would be a dream but it's just on the toes and they are so very comfortable these tie-ups are staying really well because i did a double knot on a bow at a back and a little like annalise tip for y'all that maybe a lot of people know but when you're tying up your high heels i always do a crisscross over the front a lot of people like to go on the back i do it on the front that way it shows more of the color more of the tie-up and more of the detail and just so much cuter so i'm obsessed with these so very comfortable since the heel is quite small it's really easy to walk in, I feel like I could run in these but as I nearly fall. That was embarrassing, but they are super comfortable and super easy to walk in. This haul is going really well. Like I've loved all of these shoes so far, which is absolutely amazing. So let's hope that that continues with the final few pairs. Okay, these ones are very Y2K. So y'all are either gonna love them or hate them, but I personally love them. They're giving me Lizzie McGuire vibes and these are the heels. So, are they so cool? So this is what they look like. This is the toe and then they tie up around your leg and I adore these. As I mentioned earlier, in winter I tend to opt for boots but in summer I feel like this would definitely be a staple of mine because they are so stylish. The little tie up feature is going to add some fun to any outfit and I am super excited to style these. So let's go do it. This is how I've ended up styling these shoes. I was a little unsure but I think I've done okay and I'm sorry if y'all are sick of seeing this out there. I know I wear this a lot but I really like it and feel like it's cute and I felt like the strap Ow. I felt like the strappy details on this top match well with these strappy heels. So these are super duper comfortable and I really like these. I was a little unsure when I unboxed them, I'm going to be honest. I wasn't sure if I would like them. But now that I have them on and I've felt how comfy they are, amazing. 10 out of 10. These are definitely going to be worn a lot because it literally, it just feels like I'm walking on a cloud. A cloud with like tire features because it is so incredibly soft. And as I said, these sort of heels won't hurt your, the balls of your feet because your, the feet aren't standing upwards. Instead, they are nice and flat. So I really like these. Very Y2K vibes and I am obsessed. I messed up earlier. I won't lie. I messed up. You know how earlier I was like, these pair of high heels are actually inspired by Amber Scholl because she bought the Louboutin version and I saw these on Sheen and I wanted to get them. Um, no, that was actually these ones. <laughs> the sparkly ones weren't inspired by Amber. I got confused. That was these ones. These were inspired by the Louboutins. Like, not the brand, as in I saw Amber get a pair of these in Louboutin and I was like, mm, I want that from Shein. So, anyway, this is what I meant earlier. And these are them. They are, again, that knit material. I love the crisscross detail on the toe. This actually adds more support as well because your um, the front of your foot isn't sliding around as much. So, we love that. And it is the knit detail on all of the um, strapping as well. Well, so 
Let's pull on this. That one is secure. And let's pull on the other one. Ah, also secure. I am so glad that we've made it through yet another video with none of these snapping in my hand. So let's go style and try on the lucky last pair of high heels. This is what these heels look like on and I am in love with them. So I've just kept on the dress from the intro because I think that these match perfectly. They are such a gorgeous pair of heels and most importantly, they are really comfortable. I think it's because of that knitwear. They are super duper comfy and the tie up feature is staying up because a lot of the time with these sort of heels that are tie up just a little bit they fall down but I've been wearing these for about 20 minutes now and they haven't fallen down which is absolutely amazing I'm definitely gonna wear these high heels a lot because I really don't own many white pairs of heels as I was explaining earlier and I just feel like you need a good pair of white tie up heels in your closet because they match with everything so these are gonna be a staple I'm literally in love with them and I can't wait to wear them and those are all the high heels from Cuckoo a sub brand of Shein what did you guys think I actually really liked these they are fairly cheap which is amazing and they're all really good quality which I absolutely love so I am gonna be wearing these all the time you're gonna see them all over my TikTok and Instagram so if you don't follow me on there I definitely recommend checking that out because that is where I'll be posting all of these gorgeous heels in action and if you want to shop any of these heels I of course have them linked down below along with my discount code so that you can get 15% off your entire order which is absolutely amazing thank you so much to Kaku for sponsoring today's video I really appreciate it and don't forget you guys to subscribe to my channel because I upload every single week sometimes even twice a week and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye. Mwah.